Driving students to and from Lynchburg City Schools is hitting some roadblocks, causing a lot of frustration and confusion among parents. 10 News reporter Tim Harfman is working for you to learn what's the issue and how school leaders are responding. The wheels on the bus may go round and round, but parents say they're getting the runaround from Lynchburg City Schools. We have not had a bus scheduled at all. Tiffany Martin is a Lynchburg parent who says two of her three children attend Heritage Elementary. Like many parents, they received an online link from school leaders with bus information. But Martin says there was no information, so she filled out a complaint and was forced to pick up her children. I called the school yesterday at 2 o'clock because the email came out for you to contact the school. And when I contacted the school, they had no more information. 10 News spoke with school leaders last month when LCS announced its staggering start and stop times in part to a staffing shortage. We need about 20 drivers to run a regular schedule and we don't have them. One major reason? We had a number of drivers not return after the pandemic. Uh, so yes, it, it was aggravated. Following our interview Thursday morning, Martin says she finally received her family's route information. The school has done an amazing job at doing the best they can, but, you know, it's not the bus driver's fault. It's not the school's fault. This, this truly lies with the leadership. In a statement, LCS is apologizing for the ongoing delay, saying in part, quote, Earlier this week, we discovered that there were issues with information that was uploaded into the transportation software that resulted in some families receiving inaccurate, incomplete, or no bus route information. The transportation software consultants have been working directly with LCS to resolve these issues as quickly as possible. Leaders anticipate the problem will be resolved within 48 hours. In Lynchburg, Tim Harfman, 10 News, working for you.